Raven holds on to the lead. Unbelievable. Whatever NASCAR racing is, Dale Earnhardt was. The gritty competitor that made the number three iconic, not only here in uh, Daytona, but also NASCAR-wide is remembered by all race fans every time they come here to Daytona. That number three was so important, and it took 19 years, almost two decades of trying, for Dale Earnhardt to put that number in victory lane here after the Daytona 500. But now the number three is back, and whether you love it or hate it, it's a very emotional issue for all involved. Maybe in the history of all sport, there is nothing more symbolic than the number three. The three goes much further back than Richard Childress and Dale Earnhardt. But Dale made it famous. Dale's one that took it to another level. It gave NASCAR something for those fans to pull for. Not a team, not an individual, but the three. The three really never left the minds of people, but it left the garage. Now it's coming back in the garage. I'm not Dale Earnhardt. I don't think anybody ever will be that guy. The reason that we brought it back was to be positive for the legacy of Dale Earnhardt. They understand that there are people that are going to be because they're bringing the number back, and there's going to be people that are excited about it. It's going to come back. This is the time. It's a great time to do it. And you could not have a bigger endorsement for the return of this number than Dale Earnhardt Jr. himself. He's excited about it. Richard Childress is excited about it. Yes, some fans don't like it. We've heard from them. But the vast majority of fans that we have heard from are glad to see it back. You know, the biggest thing that I noticed is behind us is International Boulevard, 90, Highway 92. There's billboards that Cheerios has put up. They get the big number three. And over here in the corner, it says Austin Dillon, very small. I think it's all about the number, and I think that's what's hard on everybody. It is, and it, it, it's emotional for everybody. I, I, I don't care whether you're an official, whether you're a fan, whether you're NASCAR, whether you don't know anything about the sport, you still tie that to Dale Earnhardt. It was Richard Childress's number, but as Richard said, said, Dale made that number. Now, I'll go back to the 43. When the King quit driving, the next year he switched to the 44. And that, that car just wasn't the same. I grew up with a 43 on the racetrack. I wanted to see a 43 car whether Richard Petty was in it or not. I want to see a three on the car because that means that his legacy, and he's still here with us in some way, shape, or form. I like the three. Well, a number we better get used to this week is...